from the time I was like seven, eight years old. I remember it just always being a struggle. A lot of the family just making sacrifices to get to the racetrack and numerous times we would take the, the race winnings for the weekend and that's what we would stop, that's what we'd eat on the way home. So to now see it all come to this point, right, that's, that makes it very humbling to say the least. The fact that I have an opportunity to do something that that very, very few people in this world ever have an opportunity to do and without the hundreds of thousands of kids that, that race any form, you know, I, I get to make a start at this level. So uh, it's pretty uh, pretty wild to think about. Um, so i just just trying to enjoy it. You know, the pressure and whatnot, all that stuff will take care of itself if, if the performance is there. So just try to, try to do my part and have fun with it. They say it's supposed to be this cold when we go green tonight. Uh, there ain't no way. It was like 15 degrees warmer. Okay. I looked at this morning. Okay. <laughs> that makes me feel better. You don't want any fans the first run, right? They run everything after. Uh, right. Okay. Unless you, like, what did I write, like, after eight, like, if you run more than eight laps, then we'll Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know the rookie meeting is by chance, right? Thank you. Thank you. Uh, what am I going to struggle with? Entry a little bit, but drive. They just seem so, so patient with it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Seems backward to me asking you, don't it? Yeah. <laughs> you doing, cool. bud? What's up? Oh, big time. Huh? What's up? Hanging out, bud. Hanging out. Why is Ricky? I'd say the biggest thing is, I mean, y'all have all made laps around here, but, um, Pit road, obviously, I would practice going under green. Sometimes we, especially the night race, we tend good to have some long green flag runs. Some of the other races y'all run, I know y'all are probably closer to the front. Sometimes in the cup cars, being in the back is tough on restarts. Um, I'll restart in third gear sometimes, just to- Just minimize. Yeah, yeah. minimize spin, but you also, um, it's kind of crazy, you're kind of stuck in the corner sometimes, and. You know the leaders are taking off. Can't see you. Know, yeah. like, you're not caught up yet, so I use third <clears> gear <throat> to restart, uh, depending on where I am. It does get slick. It does get wore out, but all the cup races do move around, so it's cool to have Stenhouse's inside on little things he focuses on. And uh, yeah, I mean, just just a new deal, right? New garage flow, new everything. So it was uh, just insightful. Well, now here's a story for several great reasons. The first is that Daniel Hemrick from Kannapolis, North Carolina, fellow who worked his way up through the Legends cars, won the Legends million. This young man has impressed me a lot in the Xfinity Series. Everything I've seen him do, he has the abilities to be a top driver in the Cup Series. I wasn't nearly as dressed as I thought it was. Just gotta live in a moment, moment bud. It's all about it. We all feel like that is setup direction we've missed. Okay. I trust you. So I want to go down, okay. back down to that, back down all the way to that first setup. I would definitely just between us, like I want to race good. I don't care about qualifying. So I, I, I just want to be able to race better than I feel like I got right now. Yeah. I just it's it's important to me to bang into the second round. I understand. Just to have a good shot at a good start. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Race. I'm with you. You know, not to have to yeah, fight, 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 fight that whole first stage. I'm looking to be, you know, yeah. twentieth. 15, something like that. So I feel like we need to come up with some adjustment to that low setup that gets us what he's talking about, which sounds to me like it's actually tightening up and then just like hitting the right rear too hard. Do you agree with that or do am I reading you the wrong way? No, like I just don't ever feel like I'm going to the gas. The only reason my throttle trace is smooth because I, I keep I beat any more throttle, I'll do this. You know what I'm saying? It's the throttle trace way it is because as soon as I gas up, the right rear tire comes around. It's, and I like so I'm driving it like straight to the fence before, and then if I get to the wall and try to tug the wheel I can still slide right retire. Richmond the pole qualifying for the Monster Energy Series is the next order of business here on FS1. I feel like it's probably gonna be a four lamp run here. Alright, if we run now it's gonna give us our only chance to cool down and run again. So Daniel, I'll put it in your hands, you run when you're ready. 
All right, copy that. Lap three at 95. All right, 10 four, nice job there. Here's Casey Kane trying to bump back in. Oh, I have almost in the green. 95 didn't get you. So you should be 23rd unless the uh, 10 did. Missed, missed it by two one thousandths oh. of a second. Oh, all good. 23rd there. Going to Q2. It's going to take a high 80, low 90 to get there. Yeah, copy that. Oh, she got there, guys. On the verge, just overall grip. Yeah, 10 more, bud. Nice job there. That's definitely a damn nice job. Drivers, start your engine! We are green in Richmond. Less than 10 laps remaining. Six, in fact, in stage number one. Christopher Bell takes the outside lane, and Hemrick got him down low. First stage win, 2018, Daniel Hemrick gets it done. Bell was second. Daniel Hemrick is free on entry. If he charges the corner too hard, he's going to keep trying to back his corner up. They're going to give him four tires and air pressure adjustment. What's up with the 21, Regan? Well, a little bit of an answer as to what's going on with that car. Just over the radio now, he said, I've got a right front tire going down. The team has asked him to try and baby it to get to the end of this run so they don't have to pit under green. Here's the problem for Daniel Hemrick. No caution, two laps to go. Second stage. Through three and four, he's gonna see the checkered flag. Second career victory, Christopher Bell hangs on in Richmond. They had a slow leaker. I think it was like so slow as it can. If it's going to go, it should go. It should go. Like, every lap went by, I thought, maybe I can make it. It uh, it was like the size of a 1032 bolt that just pressed itself through. Yeah. Obviously, the last 10 laps, like 15 laps, it's like, okay, it's flat. Timmy. But then it's like I've, I've wasted, I've given up so much time if I come down now with two laps. So, I don't know, there's, there's a no win. When you go from a, like the truck series and you go to the Xfinity series, it's like it's, everything's so stressful and everybody's, you, at least that's the perception of the event at first, you know? And then doing that yesterday to here, it was like going back over there, it was like going short track racing with, with your buddies and coming over here is like business as usual. But but then on race day, like right now, like you never have, you, you've been to the Xfinity races, like yeah. there's no time. Like everybody's just hanging out now and the music's playing, they're treating it like a, just a party. <laughs> it's, it's a cool atmosphere. How are you, man? Doing good? Yeah, you ready to go? Uh, we're about to find out. This deal's a totally different thing, that's for sure. Golly. Yeah. Or it's put me in my place. Dude, I mean, just the wheel spin you can get here. Oh, yeah. Like the flag if you want to blow the tires off. Oh, you can do it. Unbelievable. They've, they've given you more gear now. Yeah, yeah, to help you. Trip, that's that's right. Bad. Yeah. Anyways, y'all have a good well, night. You too, buddy. Good luck to you. Gonna be an item beating and banging and roughing them up. I'm done. Yeah, me too. It's not this thing. I'll try it again. Good race. Yeah. Yeah. All translates. Just remember, you belong here. You got to uh, introduce yourself to a few of these guys. Most of them are racing around. Right? Yeah. You know, a few of them have it. So. That's the one I built race cars for. It's cool. It's cool. Yeah. End of the free. End the home of the free. Hi, buddy. Have a good one. Your night making history for you, buddy. Thank you, everybody, for never, everybody, ever had an opportunity, bro. I'm just All right, here we go. Boogity, boogity, boogity. Let's go racing on this short track, boys. It's rolling here. Inside's rolling. Running into the no batter, run the floss over, all grip everywhere. Just keep working, man. We can't do anything until we get to the pits, so just keep working on your track, bar. All right, coming to stage one end.
All right, Greg, two rounds in on the right rear, two rounds out on the left rear. I know it's a combo, sorry, but we got to do a big swing here. Clear low, clear low, clear low, seven lights, clear low, clear low, all the way to the wall, all the way to the wall, seven green. Back and not even touch the gas. Looks like the rear drive is more of a precedent. Joey Logano is your stage two winner. Checker here. One back 51, just be careful when you check up here. Osler just gave up overall rim there at the end. Same direction as last time. All right, 10 four. yeah, way to hang on there. That was a good segment. We'll do a little bit more of that. We're going to do a little more air press on the right side. We'll do two rounds on the left rear. Here. Green flag. We're going racing. We're going to run 40 laps here like it's qualifying. Keep doing what you're doing there, bud. Good to straight up all. That was the one four position. Really good pace there, man. You drove away from the 11 and the 10 here. So keep working. Inside, coming to checkers. From 32nd, Kyle Busch wins Richmond. Everybody makes it across the line. Nice job, everybody. Thank you for this weekend. Thank you. Great job getting car better all night. Sorry, we uh, didn't have you a little better car early. You were real good later. The initial pace of a cup race is yeah. so much faster. Than yeah, no, it is. It is. And that's, I think that kind of caught us out a little bit, too, maybe. Yeah. As soon as we just on one time, it's like, I go in and at least wrap the bottom. I'm like, ah, this is all I got to have to manage. Run. And you were as good as the rest of our cars once that once we got oh, going. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. If not, if not a little better. So. Hey, you got to get the first one done. That's right. Good job. The emotions and everything leading into the race and being on being on the starting grid with uh, you know heroes of mine that I've watched growing up racing and all that stuff. Yeah, that, that was that was everything. And then some. I know that the positive R is is we ran in the majority of the laps and just needed. He had opportunity to reset after that first 100 laps with a clean slate. And it's racing, you don't get that shot. Um, but I learned a lot tonight, and uh, happy to be here.